Welcome back, everybody. Frank Vespi here for The Racing Biz, theracingbiz.com, and it's time for our Midlantic Racing Minute. Here's what's happening. Rich Strike says, I won the Kentucky Derby at 80-1. to 1. Wow, what a summer, replies, hold my beer. On Penn National's biggest day of the year, wow, what a summer generated one of the year's biggest payouts when he won the grade two Penn Mile at odds of 83 to one, paying his backers 168.60 on a $2 wager. Wow, what a summer got the first stakes win of his career under an astute ride from local jock Tyler Connor, who won three stakes on the evening. Wow, what a summer is trained by Chuck Lawrence. He's a homebred by summer front for Jeremy Brooks. To Delaware Park, where the three-year-old Jersey Town gelding Nosabe Nada made his first start of the season, winning a race-long duel with two-to-five post-time favorite Hero Tiger to win a June second allowance. Roberto Alvarado Jr. was in the irons. Nosabe Nada won twice as a two-year-old, including a score in the first state dash. He's never been worse than third in six career starts. He was a $2,000 yearling purchase. He's now earned nearly $150,000. He's trained by Scott Peck for R Racing Stable. To Laurel Park, and speaking of returns, Maryland Million Nursery winner Buff Hello made his first start on his home track since that victory. Ridden by apprentice Jaron Barbosa, the son of Buffum was part of the early speed, throwing down punishing early fractions. He drew well clear in mid-stretch and then had... Just enough left to hang on to win by a nose. Pennsylvania bred Buff Hello has earned nearly $130,000 with three wins from seven starts. He's trained by Claudio Gonzalez for Euro Stable, which picked him up at the Facing Tipton December mix sale. And to Charlestown, on paper, the fourth race on Saturday, an allowance shaped up as a battle between two horses who ran second in the West Virginia Breeders' Classics in successive years. But under Antonio Lopez, my boy Clyde rallied to go clear in mid-stretch, held off one of those horses, Buff's Eye View, while the other, Opera Knight, faded to fourth. My boy Clyde, a West Virginia-bred son of golden years, got his second win from seven career starts. He's a homebred for O'Sullivan Farms, trained by Javier Contreras. There's a look at the week ahead, and notably the June 8th Obia Stakes is the local Delaware prep for the Delaware Handicap, which comes up in July. And of course, the June 11th uh, Belmont Stakes is the final jewel of the Triple Crown. That's going to do it here for us on the Midlantic Racing Minute. Stay up with racing and breeding all week long on the Racing Biz, racingbiz.com. We'll catch you back here next time on the Midlantic Racing Minute. <laughs>